Hey guys, welcome back to another Cheek to Beat Sega Mega Drive edition. This time we'll be playing Bishoujo Senshi Sailor Moon. If you're new to Cheek to Beat, it's exactly what it says it is. I use cheat codes to beat a game. Uh, don't do it for boss purposes or anything like that. I do it basically just to show you how the game is and, you know, just let you see the bosses and stuff. Maybe you used to play this and you enjoyed this game or maybe it's new and you just want to see it. So uh, let's check it out. Uh, we'll start now. Huh. Let's see. Well, I'm just going to be Sailor Moon in this one since she's the main character. Nice little animation there. Juban Shopping District. Where all those Yoma, it seems the Dark Kingdom has indeed been reborn. We'll just have to defeat them again. Alright, let's do this. Okay, so this is a little bit. Is that your special? This plays a little different than the uh, Super Nintendo did. What does that do? Oh, you gotta be like, it's like a melee, like they have to be right up on it. Pick that cake up. Safety first. This uses pretty much the same enemies and stuff though. It's the, the creatures when they when they took the gems out of the people and all of them became like the dark crystal I don't remember what it was I was, I was trying to get that crystal and like everybody had a crystal inside of them and they became monsters because I remember like the grandfather he became a monster I will say something though, this one feels kind of like it plays a little smoother to a degree than the uh, Nintendo version did. I like the control seem a little smoother. That's what we do, we just trash people's vehicles. Oh, here's our elevator level. These are definitely different levels though than the Super Nintendo. At least somewhat. Whoa! <laughs> That's what I'm gonna do. Throw them out. I like how the glass just grows back. Like, it just comes back. Hurrah! <laughs> this is cool. I like just throwing them off the edge. Oh, you want to do this? I'll throw you out. This is a long elevator. Let's keep tossing them out. It just seems so much easier. Now, they're not coming back up, are they? Like... 
Like, they're not falling out and then coming back up, are they? Or is it just this long for this part of the level? Okay, yeah, that was just how long it was. You, you're the one controlling the Yoma. I am Manigan. In the name of Queen Materia, I shall punish you. Hey, that's my line. I am Sailor Moon. In the name of the moon, I will punish you. Huh? The department store is where normal folk go to unwind. Sailor Moon, make short work of this hideous Yoma. I want to get that. Get away from me. Can you tell me? Oh, it's it, that's that little heart above. It's how many it's got. Okay, that's a different way to do it. I want to finish it with that. Boom. Stage two. Dreamland. Oh, come on. It's an amusement park. I don't want to fight here. They're a yom up ahead, Sailor Moon. The sooner I defeat them, the sooner I can go play. Alright. Oh, well, <laughs> didn't mean to do that. Now this is pretty much exactly like the Super Nintendo stage was. But I could see like if you had a Sega Genesis and you did or a Mega Drive I should say and you didn't have a Famicom, I could I could see uh, getting this. This isn't too bad. It's pretty decent beat em up. Ah. You can certainly tell the graphical difference too in the Super and the Sega the way it looks. But to me, I don't really see one as looking any better than the other. They just look like two different styles to me. kind of does that same thing she does when I did that leap. That's like the thing she does in the fighting game. Whoa, what's that? Where'd I pick that up at? It's a fan. Where'd I get it at? Did I pick it up off the ground?
Huh. Yep, there's the clowns. They're bigger in this one, though. On the super, they were kind of small. They're big on this. Okay, I knew I'd eventually lose that. Is that it right there? Huh. Okay, got that one. Oh, there it went. Oh, I thought I dropped it. It looked like I dropped it, but I didn't. Beat up that chocolate. How about this? What? I gotta break this, right? Okay. It's a good weapon. Even though it wouldn't look like it would do any damage, it looks like one of those paper fans. Alright, continuing on. Wow, that is powerful. All right, moving on, break this. Now they'll come back, yeah. Alright, over here. Boom. I've brought you a present to celebrate my return. Oh, a present? What is it? Huh, <laughs> you gullible fool. It's death, of course. Death? That's a crappy gift. Couldn't you have got me something better? Enough. This ends now. Who are you? Farewell, O oh lonely wanderer who destroys the dreams of lovely maidens. Yeah, farewell, what he just said. Man, this fan is awesome. <laughs> this fan is like... Here we go. Bam! Stage three. Freeway. I don't know if I remember this level. Eek! I'm on top of a moving trailer. Get a hold of yourself. Run and the Yoma will simply chase after you. This sucks. Alright, let's do this.
Come on, you mean I gotta wait until these trucks come together? So I can hit that thing? Well, I'm just gonna go this way then. It... Oh! This is like annoying. How do you get it to... Okay. There we go. We'll just stay on this bottom one. It just seems easier. Here, throw her off. Oh, you can't. I thought you could throw her off. Ah! Oh. Kill that enemy! So annoying. Now what I do? Whoa, that's a new enemy. Got a little more health too. He's got like a double bar of health. Alright, that's it. You start doing that? I'll do that. Alright, you're gone. I suppose I'm going with this truck now. I don't know. I don't see any new enemies. Can't jump over it? Nope. Might as well just stay on this one because this is where they all appear at. Right? Oh, he got over here. And now they'll appear on that one over there. So I'll have to get down here. That's a boss. Uh, the first boss. That is. Cr I always think it's funny when games do this. When you have like a a boss and it's a literal boss, and then all of a sudden it just becomes a regular enemy. That's like really. It's like why all of a sudden now? Because I haven't got any stronger. It's not like an RPG where I've gained levels or anything. So why all of a sudden is this thing now weaker when I have not really gained in strength any? Right, that thing's dead. Now I gotta get to this guy when he gets to where he can pass down here. I better stay up on that one because that's where he's at. Okay. Next. Um, did I get on the wrong time? There's no guys appearing. There we go. Ah. Uh, really? I hate how this is random the way it moves. I really do. I'm not fond of the, the level design of this of this one. This one did wasn't in the super, and I'm not too. Now we're in the lab, so this is kind of like the super. I got too many on me. Oh. Too many of them. Gotta get them with this. I'll get them all on one side. Now, when they get on me like that, I'll put that up. You 
You know, there are aspects of this one I like better than the Super Nintendo one, though. I like the addition of the um, text parts, because it's kind of cool. It, like, at least makes it feel like the story's continuing. Like, on the Super one, there was, like, no text, really, in any of the levels. So it just felt like it was just a rush through levels and fighting bosses. Oh, come on. Can I get this one? Continue going. I'm going. Get them both on that side. Wish I had that fan again, though. That fan was a really good weapon. Okay. Oh, Nephrite, you've escaped the clutches of the Dark Kingdom again. Go see Nehru Chan. She'll be so happy. Nehru, I've no idea who that is. I shall get rid of anyone who stands in our way. Oh, you're being controlled. I'll help snap you out of it. O oh, hunter who has forgotten love, accept a bouquet of flowers into the dried wellspring of your heart. God. Farewell. Get off me! I can't even... I'm wanting to grab... Okay, that's it. I wanted to grab that. Just agitate me on that. Well, run at me again. Or jump kick me. That's a good thing to do. At least in this one, you're fighting like all the people. Like. But I think the one on the Super, none of them were the first season, were they? Escalation! One more. Stage four. Starlight Tower. Whoa, this floor is slippery. I think it's just that you're clumsy. Okay, here we go. I don't remember that. That was probably one of the monsters they fought on there. I just don't remember it. Ah! Okay, that's it. Mm. Up this way? Okay. Oh, she's headbutting that one.
caution? What's it talking about? Oh. oh come on. Alright, dude, I can't get up. Oh, I don't have enough health to do the... special attack anymore. At, okay, I'm gonna have to win I hope another one of those things falls so I can lose my health. I hope that's not the only one. Or next level will give me out. Oh, there we go. Good. Now nah, I can do it. Good. Ah. Okay, that's it. Got those two. Boom. Is there another one up there, too? Or is that just the graphics up there? Oh, that's just the graphics, I think. And for a second, I thought there was another person up there. I was like, four guys on the screen? He's going to want me to go up now. Right. Yeah. That's gonna say what caution. Where's it telling me to get? Ah, okay. Alright, now where'd I go? Oh. Ah It's those stupid clowns. I can't Stand them. I'm just gonna keep using this while they're here. Because I hate that clown. I'm going. Okay. been a while my dear we were brought back to this world by Queen Materia's power you caused me unfathomable disgrace but this time I shall triumph for Queen Materia and my beloved Kunzite never in a million years can you contend with my love power as Lord Kunzite and I are wholly devoted to one another Watch, Kunzite. This victory is for you. You just turned into me. Maybe two more? Yeah, I figured it'd be two more. Boom. Alright, let's go. Too many guys on me, so I'm just gonna do that.
Yeah, when I get that many on me, I just use that power. Okay, well, I can do this. I don't care right there. It's when they get on me like four at once, I use the power. Okay, got them. Oh, you want to slide? Okay. That's the way we'll do it then. That's the way we're going to do this? He should walk right into it, usually. Oh. Alright. If I can hit them, you know, without having to use the power, I'll do it. Because it's more damage. But when they get on me, like in a circle like this, you just gotta hit that. Okay, I thought there was. It was just these two on this side. Oh, another one of those. Ah! Okay. All right, we'll take this wall here out. What, do I got to take this out for the... Oh, come on! Break it! Jesus. I've been waiting for you, Sailor Senshi. You killed my darling Zoisite. And now you shall pay. Zoisite, please forgive me. For I failed to protect you. I shall slay our enemy and avenge your untimely death. You see, I always liked this guy in the show. This was like the one I thought was the coolest of... Queen Barrel's people, but you never really got to see him uh, do much in the show. Like, you really, he never really got to shine too much on the actual fighting them part. You see, like all the others had these big long arcs about them and stuff.
Oh, really? Okay, now we're gonna do this. Because I want to finish him with this. Is he gonna come back from behind there? There it is! And here's the final, I'm assuming the final level. D point. Yeah, because this is based on the show. That was actually the name of the episode, I think. It's cold here. I'm going to grab a coat. Absolutely not. The enemy stronghold is close by. Okay, sorry. Oh, we got a bunch of people. Well, if they all get on me, I'll do the. Yeah, I'll do this. Because that all of them. Moon healing escalation. Ah. Escalation! That's right. Oh. Okay, come here, you stupid clown. Okay. Can 
continuing on. You know, this one kind of... One thing I will say about the Sega version of this is it seems to follow the uh, manga and anime a lot more closely than the Super Nintendo game did. It may have reused some of the assets, but some a lot of the stuff has kind of got a different kind of vibe to it. I like the bosses. Moon healing escalation. Alright, moving on. Whoa. This stage looks cool. Those blue guys remind me of the, um, I don't know what race it is or whatever, but that dude that was with Jabba the Hutt in um, Return of the Jedi. Give him butts on that side. Oh, I was wondering. To... There we go. Get good combo hits in there. Oh, I got him. I just threw that thing. I was like, you know what? Get a button on that side. Thank you. 
All right. Oh, I hate these clowns. I'm just going to keep hitting this. Because they're going to keep coming at me. It's going to be like, Moon Healing Assassin! Moon Healing Escalation! Oh, you... Okay, I got you. Ooh, Queen Barrel. Well, Darien first. Huh? Lord Indiamon, are you here to rescue me? Mamaru-san? Hey, can't you hear me? Nope, apparently not. But he wasn't bad at this point. He was bad halfway through when she, uh, he got hit with that thing and she saved him. This is where all the Sailor Scouts died and then came back to give her their energy. Alright. Bending Mamaru-san to your will was a big mistake. How dare you try to steal Indiamon away from me again. I got hit by her lightning. Every time I go to hit her, that stupid lightning gets me. Dang, that's not going to be like... Oh. There we go. It's gone. It's back again. Fortunately. Moon healing escalation. This a finisher. Boom. Bye bye, Queen Barrel. Mark my words. So long as there is hate within the hearts of humankind, I shall be reborn. And then she died. Now I can go back to being a normal teenage girl. Hanging out with my friends. Talking about food, clothes, and boys. Finding joy in the little things. All I want is a normal life. With Mamaru-san. Alright. You know, I really liked that one. I thought that one was... Uh, that was definitely the equivalent to the Super. Like I said, in some ways I like this one more. Because this one seemed... To have more story than the one on the Super did. And when I have a beat em up, I like a little bit of story mixed in there. I like to at least have some semblance of what I'm purpose I'm trying to do. You know? I just don't like just random beat em I, I enjoy beat em up. So don't get me wrong. When I can play a random beat em up with no story, but I prefer mine to have like story and stuff. 
But that will be it for me. Boss cutscene video coming soon. Thank you so much, guys, for viewing the video. It means a lot to me. Leave a like and subscribe if you enjoy it. And until next time, keep up the positivity.